Hi, my name's Jeff Hutchings, and this is how to add harmonies to your vocal track in BandLab. Harmonies are usually created by adding vocal tracks that are either three semitones or four semitones higher or lower than the main vocal track. So for this demo, I'm gonna add one vocal track which is three semitones higher and one vocal track that is four semitones lower than the main vocal track. Record your vocals in BandLab, making sure the vocal track is at least one minute long. At the top of the screen, tap on the settings icon. Then make a note of the revision key. At the top of the screen, tap on the wave icon. On the track mixer screen, at the bottom left of the screen, tap on the Mixer Settings icon. Tap on the three dots on the Vocal Track header. Then tap on Rename. Name the vocal track, then tap on OK. Tap on the three dots again and tap on Download. Then tap on Gmail. At the top left of the email screen, tap on the back arrow. At the top of the screen, tap on the three lines. Then tap on Drafts. Tap on the draft email to open it. Tap on the download icon on the attached vocal track. Then exit Gmail. Open BandLab. At the top of the screen, Tap on the settings icon. Make a note of the current revision key. My current revision key is C major. Then tap on revision key. To create the higher harmonic, tap on the key that is three semitones higher than the current key. My current revision key is C major, so three semitones higher is E flat major. At the top of the screen, tap on the wave icon. Tap on the three dots on the vocal track header. Then tap on rename. Rename the vocal track so you know that it's the high harmony. Then tap OK. Tap on the three dots again and tap on download. Tap on Gmail. At the top left of the email screen, Tap on the back arrow. Then at the top of the screen, tap on the three lines. Tap on Drafts. And tap on the draft email to open it. Tap on the download icon on the attached vocal track. Then exit Gmail. Open BandLab. At the top of the screen, tap on the settings icon. Make a note of the current revision key. My current revision key is E flat major. Then tap on revision. To create the lower harmonic, tap on the key that is seven semitones lower than the current key. My current revision key is E flat major, so seven semitones lower is A flat major. At the top of the screen, Tap on the wave icon. Tap on the three dots on the vocal track header. Tap on rename. Rename your vocal track so you know that it's the lower harmonic. Then tap OK. Tap on the three dots again and tap on download. Tap on Gmail. At the top left of the email screen, tap on the back arrow. At the top of the screen, tap on the three lines. Then tap on the Drafts folder. Tap on the Draft email to open it. Then tap on the Download icon on the attached vocal track. Now exit Gmail. Now that I've created my vocal tracks, I need to put the revision key for the song back to the original revision key so the song plays in the right key. Then I can add my vocal track back into the song. Open BandLab. At the top of the screen, tap on the settings icon. 
tap on the revision key, then tap on the original revision key you noted at the beginning. Mine was C major, so I will tap on C major. At the top of the screen, tap on the wave icon. Tap on the three dots on the vocal track header. And tap on remove. Tap on yes on the pop-up message. Now below the bottom track and to the right of the screen, tap on the plus icon. Tap on import audio MIDI. Then tap on your original vocal track in your downloads folder. Tap on the three dots on the imported tracks header and tap rename. Then enter a name for your track and tap OK. Below the bottom track and to the right of the screen, tap on the plus icon. And tap on Import Audio MIDI. Tap on the High Harmony Vocal track in your Downloads folder. Tap on the three dots on the imported tracks header and tap Rename. Enter a name for your track and tap OK. Below the bottom track and to the right of the screen, tap on the plus icon. Tap on Import Audio MIDI. Then tap on the Low Harmony Vocal track in your Downloads folder. Tap on the three dots on the imported track's header and tap Rename. Then enter a name for your track and tap OK. To create a more professional harmony, I'm going to blend the harmony tracks with the vocal track. So I'm going to add some reverb to the harmony tracks. I'm going to add a low pass filter to the high harmony track to smooth out the high notes and a high pass filter to the low harmony track to smooth out the low notes. Then I'm going to pan both the harmony tracks slightly to the left and to the right of the main track and then adjust the volumes so that it all blends in nicely. At the bottom left of the screen, tap on the mixer icon. Double tap on the microphone icon on the low harmony track. At the bottom of the screen, tap on effects. Tap on the plus icon on the none effects icon. Then near the top right of the FX screen, tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs and tap on the Tone tab. Then tap on Multi Filter. Tap on the list box to the right of the word Type. Then tap on High Pass. Drag the green dot on the line to the right of the word Frequency to the left until it says about 100 Hz below the word Frequency. Near the top right of the FX screen, tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs and tap on the Reverb tab. Then tap on Space Maker. At the top left of the FX screen, tap the back arrow. At the top right of the screen, tap the V icon. Double tap on the microphone icon on the High Harmony track. At the bottom of the screen, tap on effects. Tap on the plus icon on the none effects icon. Near the top right of the FX screen, tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs and tap on the tone tab. Tap on multi filter. Tap on the list box to the right of the word type and tap on low pass. Drag the green dot on the line to the right of the word frequency to the left until it says about 100 hertz below the word frequency. Near the top right of the FX screen, tap on the plus icon. Scroll through the tabs and tap on the reverb tab. Then tap on Space Maker. At the top left of the FX screen, tap on the back arrow. At the top right of the screen, tap on the V icon. At the bottom left of the screen, tap on the Mixer icon. 
Place your finger on the pan icon on the High Harmony track header and drag your finger up the screen until it says 20R in the pop-up message. Then place your finger on the pan icon on the Low Harmony track header and drag your finger down the screen until it says 20L in the pop-up message. Finally, adjust the volume on the High and Low Harmony track headers to blend the harmonies into the vocal track. There is no one so blind As those who choose not to see If you've enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.